hey guys look at my screen when i'm typing anything on this jupyter notebook you can see there's a auto complete feature which is working in the background for example i would like to import pandas it helps me with certain auto complete feature which suggest me what to which one to choose now this is very important while you are writing code you may not recall the exact name so by typing few words when it comes as a suggestion that really helps during coding right so how to get this in this video let's see let me show you the simple step by step process to get this on onto your jupyter notebook now before we start let's close any jupyter notebook instances that you might have opened so i'm going to simply close it now once this is done on your search bar simply type anaconda okay here you find a prompt anaconda prompt okay open this anaconda prompt if you have installed jupyter notebook using anaconda or else through powershell or using command prompts also you can try but again i would recommend you to do it on the anaconda prompt now how to do it where is the documentation for it okay so there is a extension called jupyter simply type jupyter contrib nb extension now looking at the name it generally you will have a question what is the meaning of this contrib nb extensions what is it so nb extension stands for notebook okay nb means notebook extensions contrib means contributed by the community for the jupyter for the jupyter notebook there is a notebook extension contributed by the community that is the generic meaning of jupyter underscore contrib underscore nb extensions okay now in this page you would find the command to install from multiple different ways one is you simply type pip install jupyter contrib extension simply copy this but you can just type it on your command on your anaconda prompt okay you can try it on the command prompt as well but but i have seen you may have some problem so better to do it on anaconda prompt if not try with command prompt so i have given the command let me hit on enter now you can see it will take some time for it to install completely so let it complete its process so you can see a sentence here installing collected packages jupyter contrib nb extensions so you can easily remember this jupyter notebook extensions contributed by the community something like that so here finally i got a message successfully installed jupyter contrib nb extension 0.7.0 okay so this is all done now what i'm going to do i'm going to simply close this and i'm going to type jupyter notebook you will see this prompt and soon after that the jupyter notebook will start opening up so i have landed onto the home page okay now here i will select my file is actually there in the desktop i'll select folders and here i'll go to the desktop and uh, automate with rakesh this is my file now do you know the meaning of i p y n b what is it i means interactive p y means python notebook interactive python notebook okay so it has launched let me show you once you have installed nb extensions just go to this nb extensions so once you go to the nb extension if it is disabled simply enable it once you enable just look for this hinterland okay there is something written here called hinterland what is it if you highlight this it gives you an explanation at the bottom enable code auto completion menu for every key press in a code cell instead of only enabling it with so this is what the auto complete feature would work for so i'm going to simply go and enable hinterland okay by doing this now if you try to refresh the page or try to reopen the page let me reopen it now let me try some code you can see it is automatically helping me to get the code what i need so thank you guys for watching this is the simplest way and please do comment if you are able to get this done on your jupyter notebook do comment that you are able to get it thank you guys for watching let's meet once again in our next content and give it a like to this video if this video has helped you mm -hmm.